We're not the only ones being hit with snow. Texas is getting inches of it. At least 40 flights were canceled, including one that was supposed to bring a Spokane soccer team home tonight. The all girls team went to Texas for a nationwide tournament. They were hit with freezing rain, high winds and snow tonight. They're in a hotel room and can't get a flight back to Washington until Thursday. New on Nightside, Caitlin Knapp shows us the struggles the team is going through. Snow and freezing temperatures aren't anything new for this Eastern Washington team. Seeing that weather in Texas, unexpected for sure. But what the team also didn't expect was that they would be stuck there. A weekend of fun on the field. We saw the forecast, but I don't think we realized it was going to be this bad. Turned into a trip this Eastern Washington soccer club won't forget. Two teams left for Austin late last week. Cold, I would say in Spokane. Um, surprised to find that it was as cold or colder in Texas. They started their games on Saturday. This type of cold is like we're not used to the wind because the wind is super like it hits our face and like hits our leg. The tournament cut short because of the weather. When the team went to the airport today, flights started to cancel left and right. We ended up trying to get hotels because everyone was scrambling to get hotels was a, was a challenge. And that wasn't the only struggle. Everything shut down. I mean, gas stations, grocery stores, restaurants, fast food. There's, there's literally nothing that you can find. We just found a little pizza place that opened up um, tonight for a few hours. Tonight? They're riding out the storms. Right now we were playing Uno. Last night we played some games. Then we're just like watching Netflix. And making the best out of an inconvenient situation. We have a great group of players, a great group of coaches. We're handling it like champs. And um, no, we're just embracing the moment to be able to have some good team bonding. The teams have a flight out on Thursday. Austin will be under another winter storm warning the night before. If they have to stay, they told me they'll simply make the best of it. In studio, Caitlin Knapp for News Nightside.